Welcome to Instrumentation and Control Channel. In this video you will learn all about thermocouple. Be patient. Watch the video from beginning to end in next 15 minutes you will be able to learn all about thermocouple theory and practical. I will cover following topics in this video. Thermocouple theory. Construction of thermocouple. How to check thermocouple. Thermo well. Installation. Calibration check. Industrial application. What is thermocouple and what is the theory behind it? A thermoelectric device for measuring temperature, consisting of two wires of different metals connected at two points, a voltage being developed between the two junctions in proportion to the temperature difference. This phenomenon is called Siebsk effect. The term thermoelectric effect encompasses three separately identified effects the Seebeck effect, Peltier effect. And Thomson effect. The Peltier Seebeck and Thomson effects are thermodynamically reversible. In figure 1, metal A and metal B2 dissimilar metal connected at a point called measuring or hot junction. When this junction is heated, an EMF is induced, which is directly proportional to temperature difference between two junction. So remember, thermocouple does not measure the exact process temperature. It measures the Difference between exact temperature minus reference temperature that is ambient temperature. So to get exact temperature or process temperature you have to add ambient temperature. Peltier effect is opposite to the Seebeck effect. When an electric current is passed through a circuit of a thermocouple, heat is evolved at one junction and absorbed at the other junction. When the current direction reversed, hot junction get cool and cold junction get hot. Current passes through two dissimilar metal copper and ferrous. Thomson effect. According to this effect, if a conductor has placed in varying temperature along its Length and current is passed through it then it will absorb or revolve heat. Absorbing or evolving heat will depend on direction of current. It consists of two conductors welded together at measuring point and insulated from each other along the length. You can see in the picture how a real thermocouple looks like. This is how thermocouple junction looks like. This picture tell you about the loop how a thermocouple connected to a DCS or a controller. You can remember I told you that thermocouple does not measure the exact process. Temperature dot it measure the temperature difference between exact temperature minus reference temperature that is ambient temperature so to get exact temperature or process temperature you have to add ambient temperature that is called compensation the voltage generated by a thermocouple is a function of the temperature difference between the measurement and reference junctions traditionally the reference junction was held at zero degrees celsius by an ice path the ice path is now considered impractical and is replaced by a reference junction compensation arrangement. This can be accomplished by measuring the reference junction temperature with an alternate temperature sensor, typically an RTD or thermistor, and applying a correcting voltage to the measured thermocouple voltage before scaling to temperature. The correction can be done electrically in hardware or mathematically in software. The software method is preferred as it is universal to all thermocouple types, provided the characteristics are known, and it allows for the correction of the small non-linearity over the reference temperature range. Here you can see type of thermocouple, their accuracy, range and uses, construction of thermocouple and their uses. The construction of the thermocouple is shown below. It comprises of two different metal wires and that are connected together at the junction end. The junction thinks as the measuring end. The end of the junction is classified into three types namely ungrounded, grounded and exposed junction. 
Thermo wells are cylindrical fittings used to protect temperature sensors installed in industrial processes. A thermo well consists of a tube closed at one end and mounted in the process stream. If the sensor fails, it can be easily replaced without draining the vessel or piping. Thermocouple inserted inside thermo well. Thermo wells are cylindrical fittings used to protect temperature sensors installed in industrial processes. A thermo well consists of a tube closed at one end and mounted in the process stream. If the sensor fails, it can be easily replaced without draining the vessel or piping. Thermocouple color codes is different in different country. Sensor achieving 63.2% of the final reading is called time constant. Dot smaller the time constant better response of thermocouple. EMF versus temperature curve of different type of thermocouple. How to determine the measuring junction temperature? First measure the millivolt in thermocouple head dot for example it is 3.401 millivolt. Then measure the millivolt in reference junction dot for example it is 22 degree Celsius dot find corresponding millivolt from chart dot here it is 0.87 dot millivolt. Add the 2 millivolt 3.401 plus 0.87 and it is 4.28 millivolt. Now find the corresponding temperature from the chart and it is 100 degree Celsius. Find the corresponding millivolt from the chart. Installation precaution should be taken during thermocouple cable A. As the signal is very low you have to keep away your cable from electromagnetic induction. A temperature bath is used to check the thermocouple performance. Temperature bath consists of temperature blower to heat, a cooler, a temperature element to compare the temperature, a temperature controller to control the temperature with set point. Suppose you want to check a thermocouple in 100 degrees Celsius. First insert the thermocouple inside the bath. Set the temperature to 100 degrees Celsius. Now wait until the temperature is unstable at 100 degrees Celsius. Again give 150 degrees Celsius and check it. Dot this way you can check with 50 degree temperature graduation and again decrease in same manner step by step. Now you are ready to go. Thanks for watching. Please like. Subscribe to motivate and for upcoming new videos and put your notification on.